In this lecture, we will check how pointers can be used. I am taking one example where I am declaring an integer variable a equal to 10. After that, I am declaring my pointer. So what pointer is doing over here? I am using indirection operator at star and initializing an integer pointer named as ptr and I am initializing it to address of location a which is variable that I have declared over here address of variable a and after that i am printing three integers first i am writing star at the rate a in the previous lecture we have seen that this star can be replaced with value at so if we just simply read it what printf statement will be printing over here is value at address of a that will be 10. similarly in the next line we can write star and inside of parenthesis address of a so both are same it is just to make it better understandable i'm writing it like this so this will also print 10 alternatively here we are writing star ptr so star again is value at and ptr because it stores address of a so this is something like this again okay so this will also give me same result 10 okay so this will make your understanding of pointers clearer 10 is the value which is stored at a however using its pointer I'm still able to print that value. This is very basic concept of pointers. If you have understand this, there is nothing much complicated into pointers. In the next lecture, we will continue our study on learning about functions and how different types of parameters can be passed to it.